Hi folks. Okay, let's go ahead and um, change our uh, title color of our on our banner here. This is where it's located. Uh, the default theme, of course, we have this black uh, standard uh, font uh, in our title. So I want to change it to uh, a blue color. And uh, we're going to be, again, using Fire, Firebug for this. So if you don't have it, go out and get this free um, development tool. You will need it. Um, now, some themes, most themes, actually you can change this within, you know, your theme. But since we're working off of the default theme, we want to show you how to do it by hand. And you will use these skills later on, of course. Um, and it's just something good to know if you're going to be, you know, building, building pages and sites. Okay, so we have Firebug uh, turned on here. Now with Firebug, you get to inspect all the different elements and divs uh, within your website. If I go over here and click on this element, you'll see as I hover over, everything gets highlighted down here in our HTML. And then over here, we get to look at the style sheet of things. So let's go right up here, because this is the one we're focusing on, and this is our title. Um, now there's two parts to this. You can see we can expand it there, and then we can expand it in here. We're just going to concentrate on this. This is all within the banner div, basically. This is all enclosed within uh, a larger element. But we're going to focus in right on this one. So if I click on it and highlight it, down here you can see it's highlighted and over here we get to see what it is and here's our ID our class it's our site title A there it is and there's our color black now of course you could just go in here and I'm gonna go for like a blue color you just click in there and get it highlighted and you could just type in a color and I think I'm just gonna go with a blue now if you want a different color for instance Let's go up here and grab our instant uh, eyedropper. Uh, this is another free tool. If I take this and drag it over here, you can see I get the color code for it. And if I wanted to go with that, I would just let go, capture that color, and then go back over here and then just control V or paste to paste that in. And you can see over here it changes. Um, so this is the one we're dealing with, this site title A. So let's just highlight that and copy it because this is where we're going to go in our style sheet to change this color. So let's go over here to the site. We're going to go into appearance and then we're going to go down to the editor. And we're going to edit the CSS code so we can change that color. Now, of course, when you're in your style sheet, we're already in the style sheet. Whenever you make changes, of course, you want to, you know, select it all, make sure you copy it save it in a safe place so that you you know if you mess up you're not going to be locked you're not going to lock yourself out on this particularly but you could you know goof up somehow and things do happen I'm going to go up here to edit and I'm going to go to find to open up a little box down here and then I'm just going to paste in that site title A here and right here it takes us right to it and you can see now we have that color that font and there's no decoration on it and this is where we can go in and just change that color because over here you can see we have the color but if I refresh the screen you can see that it turns back to its original black because within Firebug doesn't actually uh, you just get to see what the change you're going to make in here you can you know, set it up so that you can go straight and change it within but this is just to basically view it because you could if you could change it in here you could go out to anybody's website and change their stuff so let's go back over here now and we're in the right area and I'm just gonna type in blue since I know I just want a, a basic blue for that I'm gonna go ahead and update that let's go back over here it's black now let's refresh the screen and you can see now we've got a blue so that's kinda what I want to do there I don't really like that font so let's do one more let's just add one more thing to this uh, let's go over here we see we have text decoration if you hit enter and then enter again and you get down you can open up a space here and what we could do is we could change the font uh, family on this tab over and I like uh, I think like a Times Roman and as you can see that changes that to a nice uh, you know a, a better a better font so I think I like that um, 
yeah I'm gonna go ahead and do that so we know that that's what we want to do let's go back over here and we're already within the area we need to be and all we need to do here if we just go to the end here let's just hit a return and let's just tab over and type in font family okay make sure you put your uh, your um, your colon there and then we're gonna go uh, times I think is it Roman and then put your I think that's it let's go back let me go back here real quick just to make sure I have that right times new Roman okay so it's times new Roman okay we could actually just copy that just like that but so it's times should we get this right new Roman and let's see if we got that right I'm gonna go back here real quick and just refresh to s so we can see that's what we do have and if I go back here and then hit update let's see if it took uh, if we got the right one yeah there we go so now we have a l better font uh, yeah, and to take this one step further even let's say that um, you know that's that's a little small now I mean we could actually go in here and then add font you know size to this but let me go back to the element here and let's click on the big picture because within this we should be able to get um, yeah see if I click on the the bigger get the full div in here you can see we already have a font size in there and if I wanted to make that say 40 you know that would take that up and that looks pretty decent so again we're in site title but we don't have that A we just have the site title there and we know it was at 30 we want to put it at 40 let's go back to the style sheet and if we just back that off you know you'll see we'll get we back that off to just site title and now here we are site title see there's a 30 let's just take that and make it a 40 okay and then let's go back here let's just refresh just to see that where we're at we're gonna go save it and then we're going to go back over here and let's refresh now and we got a nice bigger larger font um, I don't know that I like it bold and I'll probably go back and take out the bold and just put that to normal um, but I don't I won't walk you through that I mean I think uh, you should be able to get the gist of how we can go in and do some things here see over here the font weight is bold if I go and just put it at normal that's probably a better that's probably a better look and I'll probably go back and do that you can use this for many things guys um, this gives you an idea once again you, you, you as you probably already know I love fire firebug and I use it a lot and you will too and I hope you've enjoyed this this little this free video and I'll see you in the members area thanks for watching mm -hmm.